Good evening ladies. An MB7 PBH update for you. Here's the transmitter you might have seen on the other video. And its software is running under virtualization via VirtualBox. And there's the software. Now what we see here on the Windows 10 running this software is you have uh, the frequency there 439.9875 2 watts output and the RIC code is 2352060 which is ha just happens to be my um, DMR ID one of them and that's the canned message auto trigger channel 0 MB7 PBH testing RIC 2352060 2 watts transmitter output that's the message that goes out similarly similarly the uh, the other message on trigger 1 same frequency same power uh, same board rate as well that's 519 transmit board rate and this one is 2352061 so there's one ends in 1 rather than 0 and there, there again is a can message I made a a wee um, development box for this. Which probably can't see it too well. No, it's not great, is it? Um, but it's basically an old switch box, um, and so that is a single wire that goes to the transmitter up on the DIN rail. Um, you press that, and that's can message one. Oh, zero roll, and there it is on the pager, which you won't be able to see too well, but there it is, auto trigger, that one, and then the lower button sends a low to the transmitter, and now that comes on the other one. I managed to get these um, <coughs> two scopes, I've had them for ages, and uh, the parts were protected by default, they're zero, 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 zero. But I got lucky and found the, the um, pass, password for them. Uh, and they only go down to 454, but uh, they're in lock. So don't know how sensitive they'll be down there on 440, but uh, we shall see, I suppose, when we do some range testing. So you got the, um, uh, yeah, you got the, the old, old style controller there. That's what puts it into, into programming mode there. Um, and that interface is with the PC via uh, RS-232 from USB and yeah so I could actually send messages from the PC if I had the right software haven't, haven't managed to find some yet um, but we'll see so that's um, yeah, out of programming mode uh, and that's that and then um, I'm playing with an Arduino here I'll just pause a sec right I'm back so uh, I've got my finger on the reset uh, button there. Arduino, with just two two lines that go to uh, the backs of those two switches there. Uh, and an LCD display on the front there. And so that's sending to, to zero now. The first pager goes off. And there goes the second one. Let's kill those. And then there's a time routine, a delay routine. Chevron there indicates the last one that fires up, and that value is the elapsed time. So there goes zero again. And we wait a little bit. I'm going to put a countdown timer on there instead of saying sending. And there's that one. So, oh yeah, see? Clever enough. I'll just flick that on to program now, which will inhibit it from sending. So there you are. Just a quick um, video update of uh, what I've been up to. Code is um, behind the virtual box. Oh, let's kill that light there. That should be better. Yeah, it's quite simple, really. It just um, it's a for loop integer i is two and less than four, which is in other words three increments there plus plus i uh, LCD. Yeah, that, that puts um, sending on the screen. So this is where we start sending. 
and then if i is is two which it starts off as two then the cursor is set to uh, halfway down on the on the bottom line that clears that clears a chevron and prints a new chevron uh sets the cursor there not really sure what i've done that there but anyway uh yeah, and that prints elapsed time. Same here, only different variables that, that prints on the on the top line. Uh, uh, clears the top line, prints the cursor on the bottom line, prints the cursor there. Um, set the cursor. I don't know why I've done that. I have to look up. Let's see what I've done there. And then uh, yeah, write the write that pin low, which asserts low on whatever pin it is, um, because it, it's pin I. And yeah, and then and a short delay, uh, then it goes high again, another delay, a bit clunky those delays, but there we are. Uh, and uh, yeah, that, that uh, prints over, uh, nulls out the, the word sending. And then, uh, yeah, drops out the bottom. So there you go, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a nice weekend.